Hi guys, how's it going? And welcome back to another match day vlog. Today we face Bristol Rovers away. I wasn't 100% sure if I was going today until this morning, but I have decided I'm gonna go. So we've got another vlog and another away there on the channel. Of course, Bristol Rovers, they sit 12th. Um, they were on a decent bit of form after beating Port Vale, drawing against Bolton, and of course, beating Charlton 2-1. However, they have lost two in a row. Of course, the 4-3 thriller at the Memorial Ground against Exeter City in their last game, with two late goals from Exeter, winning the three points for the Grecians. Uh, Joey Barton will want to turn that around today, and no doubt he'll be able to. It's whether we can respond. Of course, we come in off the back of a 1-0 win away at Shrewsbury. We did, you know, ride our luck a bit, but I thought we were solid at times. And, you know, we started really poorly and to bounce back from that poor start and end up actually playing some decent football in that game was a big positive. So hopefully we can take the positives from that going into today. Fingers crossed we can get a result. I'm going to give a score prediction. I'm going to go for a 2-1 loss. I just think... One, we're never that good at the Memorial Ground, but two, Bristol Rovers are just too much of a solid side, and I think Joey Barton's man will have the better of us today. But yeah, only time will tell. Your score predictions will be on the screen now, as always. And if you do go on to enjoy today's match day vlog, please do smash like and subscribe. It'd be massively appreciated. Thank you for all the support of late. It's been crazy with all the vlogs on the channel. I've been working hard, but I've been enjoying it at the same time, and thank you for showing the love. We are on the road to 2,000 subscribers, so if you could help me hit that, it'd be massively appreciated. But yeah, without further ado, let's head to Bristol. Alright then, so the lineups are now out. Some interesting choices today. Ollie Inc comes back into the squad. Jackson and Ferry back down to the bench. I don't quite know what the thinking is behind that, but interesting choices nonetheless. The usual suspects of Southwood and Gold, May and Lundaloo, etc. However, we do have Perry coming into the squad for Elliot Bonds as well, which I think is a good choice. So, hopefully that choice pays off, but only time will tell. It's a decent old start on 11, and hopefully the lads that are chosen today will put out a decent performance and maybe get some points, but I just still can't see it, especially now with this squad. We'll have to wait and see. But yeah, let's go to kick off. Go 1 0. Go for the visitors. Oh, pull up. Oh, pull up. Pull up. Pull up. Pull up. Pull up. Pull up. Fucking hell! Fucking loyal faker! Fucking hell! 
Was two Charlton now expected, but last second goal. It, I mean, for one, it's disappointing that we've conceded another chance via a through ball straight through our defence. Um, but I, I, I've watched it back, and don't come at me if I'm wrong. But from from our angle, we are 99% sure that he was offside. I don't know how the line now hasn't seen it because it, it, he's perfectly in front of it. He's in a good position to see it, and he hasn't. So. Goodness knows how. I mean, you know, it was more that, that that goal was more offside than the offside that they called when they scored after that, and that was a lot closer. So, yeah, not ideal, but our performance has been pretty poor. Uh, we're conceding way too many passes in behind through the middle of our defence. But yeah, hopefully for about a second and a half. I can't see out then. Only time will tell. Let's go second and a half. <laughs> What's up? Oh, uh, no, one nil second off. Come on! 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 Come on!
Roy then, full time, Bristol Rovers 2, track and 1. Um, fair play, we really battled in that second half. We just lacked the quality in the final third. We need to get better at taking chances in the air from crosses, etc. Um, I, I thought we were fairly solid in the second half. By far the better side. Uh, they got away lucky, I think, to get the three points today. But, you know, they stuck it out and fair play to them. And that's why, you know, that's why they are where they are in the league. They, they've done this all season. They have had moments of brilliance, but... They are a solid side and they were hard to break down today and it's a credit to them and Joey Barton, it's a fair play. But I, I don't want to mention it, but I think we've been hard done by, by that second goal. If it was offside, I'm 99% sure it was, but it would have been a different outcome today. But it is what it is. We move on to Morecambe next Saturday, of course. We do have another vlog on the channel tomorrow. Birmingham City versus Middlesbrough. So hopefully that's a good game. Yeah, thank you very much for watching. If you didn't drop your smash like subscribe, it must be appreciated. Have a class yesterday and I'll see you for Birmingham City versus Middlesbrough.